welcome back to our channel. On our channel this time, we want to talk about the top 10 guitar effects pedals for 2020. Some effect pedals were designed to deliver a handful of crucial effects. In contrast, others may focus on offering a smorgasbord DSP, expandable with as many simulations and results as the internet can provide for a downloadable amp and speaker. Comparing them only by numbers can be tempting, though that may not be the most beneficial strategy. It's essential to understand what you will need, like buying every other piece of gear. Smaller form devices like the TC Electronic Plethora X5 will comfortably fit on a pedal board with other stomp boxes, whereas more significant offers such as the Kemper Profiler Stage were not only designed to replace your pedal board completely, but also your amplifier and cabinet. Don't forget to hit subscribe and the like button and press the bell icon for regular updates. Number 10 is TC Electronic Plethora. The Plethora, first teased back in September 2019 as the long-awaited tone print pedal board, opens the signature tone print technology of TC Electronic into something more robust and customizable. The device itself allows you to put together preset boards, each made up of five distinct effects, most specifically imitating a classic of TC Electronic, such as the reverb of the Hall of Fame. With an external effects loop, you can also add your effects to the mix and wirelessly edit presets using your phone and the Tone Print app. This device can substitute an entire pedal board amp rig with cab simulation and a very busy I.O. section. Models, N.A. Effects, 75 tone prints, 5 at a time, 127 custom pedal board combinations. I.O. 2 quarter inch inputs, 2 quarter inch outputs, quarter inch send and return, MIDI in through, one quarter inch speech output, price of £395, $750, type multi-effects with tone print amp. Number 9 is the Carl Martin Acoustic Gig. It is typically electric players considered when considering multi-effects units. Perhaps they are trying to condense a spaceship-sized pedal board into a single unit or look for something more compact than a vintage tube amp. The effect pedals also take a practical, more subtle approach for the acoustic player. One that does just that is the Carl Martin. They're also all voiced to take piezo pickups, so when using an electronic-focused machine, there's none of the unnecessary quack you might get. There's also a tuner and tap tempo for the echo to make gigs easier, as well as the option for XLR or quarter-inch out. The acoustic gig is loaded with a phase inverter if you're worried about feedback while boosting your signal. Price of £479, $630. Model NA. Effects 5. Preamp, Compressor, Echo, Reverb, and Boost. I.O. 1. 1 quarter inch inputs, 1 quarter inch output, 1 XLR output, quarter inch send and return. I.O. 1 quarter inch inputs, 1 quarter inch output, 1 XLR output, quarter inch send and return. I.O. 1 quarter inch inputs, 1 quarter inch output, 1 XLR output. Number 8 is Moore GE250. A fair bit more compact and every bit as strong is Moore's new multi effects machine. There are 11 blocks into which you can load a combination of 180 effects by taking signals from the GE300. These can consist of 70 amp models included in 32 speaker cabinet models based on impulse response. Support for third-party IRs has also been extended compared to the GE300 to allow for higher resolution images. If it doesn't quite cut this large number of amps or don't want to abandon your standard amp rig, the unit also allows you to use Moore's Tone Capture Tech to create a model of your actual amplifier. Price of £366, $450. Model 70. Effects 180. I.O. 1 quarter inch input, 2 quarter inch outputs, 2 XLR outputs. Type multi effects with IR loading. Amp models 70. Effects 180. I.O. 1 quarter inch input, 2 quarter inch outputs. Number 7 is Line 6 Pod Go. It has more in common with the Helix than the old pod units at first sight, and that's also true under the hood since it runs off the same base modeling software. It implies that it comes fitted with over 300 amps and effects taken from the Helix, M-Series, and legacy libraries of Line 6. 
It even supports third-party IRs if that's not enough. It's a little more compact than the Helix units that are fully fledged, allowing you to run up to six simultaneous amp, cab, and impact blocks at any time. You can also create four more variations on a preset using the new snapshot function and turn between them at the push of a foot switch. The unique inclusion of an expression pedal has been squeezed into 313 by 520 by 148 mm relatively small machine footprint. Price, 513 pounds, $630. Type, multi-effect pedal with IR loading amp. Models, over 300. Effects, over 270. I.O., one quarter inch input, two quarter inch main output, one quarter inch amp output, quarter inch send and return. Number six is Event Hide H9 Max Harmonizer. Although the H9 Max Harmonizer from Eventide is reminiscent of HAL 9000, we assure you it is not out to assassinate you. However, to please even the most critical tone snob, it has killer studio quality sound, a wealth of onboard effects, and deep programmability. The H9 Max for secessionists and studio musicians can very well be the desert island pedal. In Eventide's H9 Control app, the real magic of H9 Max lies. Think of this as the Stompbox Command Center. It allows you to load and build presets, manage parameters, and even remotely control the H9 via Bluetooth. The software is also home to more than 500 tons of presets and algorithms that can be downloaded. Price of $699, £629. Type, Stompbox Amp Multi-Effects. Models, NA. Effects, 49. I.O. 2 inputs of 1 quarter inch, 2 outputs of 1 quarter inch. Number 5 is the Line 6 HX Stomp. The HX Stomp is a lightweight programmable device brimming with amp and cab sims, products, and impulse response, IR. The smaller sibling to Line 6's HX effects. The variety of capabilities of the HX Stomps make it well suited for various uses. As a mega stomp box, you can deploy it and add on for other modelers an audio interface or the main guitar rig. For fan of Line 6's legacy effects, there is also a treat with the company bringing over products from its N series pedals along with four classic stomp box models DL4, MM4, FM4, and DM4. A vividly colored LCD screen and three capacitive sensing foot switches with LED rings are at the top of the feature set. Price of $559, £558. Type, lightweight multi-effect pedal amp. Models, 77 with 37 SIM cabinet. Effects, 206. I.O. 2 quarter inch inputs, 2 quarter inch outputs, quarter inch send and return, MIDI in, out, quarter inch expression in, out, quarter expression in, out. Number 4 is Boss MS3. Look no further than a Boss's MS3 if you are on the quest for an effect loop switcher with a high quality multi-effect engine. Although the system stands out as a routing workhorse, it has three different loops of effects. It also fills in the gaps for effects you might miss, and although in your current setup, the MS3 can. It takes some preparation, particularly if you are thinking of using it in a live show. A limitation with the MS3 is the inability to change the loop's sequence, so chart your signal paths carefully. Type, multi-effect pedal with external loop switch amp, models NA, effects 118, IO, input 1 quarter inch instrument, 3 quarter inch loop returns, 2 quarter inch control in expression, output 2 quarter inch main, 3 quarter inch loop sends, 1 quarter inch control out, MIDI output 2 quarter inch control in expression, Output, 2 quarter inch main, 3 quarter inch loop sends, 1 quarter inch control out. Number 3 is Tech 21 Fly Rig 5. Tech 21's Fly Rig, launched in 2014, won applause for offering a great tone in a slimmed down pedal configuration. Apart from its wealth of effects, the original Fly Rig star feature was the all analog Sansamp technology, which gave it the sound and feel of a real stomp box. Tech 21 has modified the original fly rig formula with an individual reverb with the fifth iteration of the pedal that allows you to change room sizes, a tuner, an XLR output, and an effects loop. It brings a total of five impacts to it. 
Of course, the SanSam technology has been preserved, along with common choices such as the Plexi Cali Crunch alternative and the Vintage Tape Echo's Tap Tempo features. I.O. 1 quarter inch input, 1 quarter inch main output, 1 XLR based output, price of $425, type multi-effect pedal board amp, models N.A., effects 5, boost, plexi, blonde, delay, and reverb. I.O. 1 quarter inch input, 1 quarter inch main output. Number 2 is the Nux MG100. The Nux MG100 is a multi-effects processor that is designed for beginner guitarists at the entry stage, and it has to fit the price tag. It's just $100. It gives you a taste of effect chaining by allowing you to pick 8 out of a total of 58 effects and engage them simultaneously. Alongside utility options such as a compressor, a 6-band EQ, as well as a noise gate, the pedal effects library contains the normal drives, reverbs, modulations, and delays. Not only does the MG100 excel in the categories of effects and amp sim, but its built-in drum machine and looper also makes it ideal for gigging in rehearsal too. The former equips you with 56 patterns of rhythm, while the latter makes 40 seconds each of limitless overdubs. Practice should be a breeze with these in tow. Price of £81, $99. Type, Pedal Multi-Effect Amp. Model, 13. Models 11 cabs, effects 58, I.O. 1 quarter inch input, 1 quarter inch output, 1 aux. Number 1 is Behringer FX600. Seeing this one on a list of the best multi-effects pedals is a surprise. But Behringer's FX600 is one of the most value for money stomp boxes you can find, let alone multi-effect devices, for the cost of 4 packs of strings. With six modes, the pedal arms you flanger, chorus, phaser, delay, tremolo, and pitch shifter, but no drives or verbs are available. However, all of them are digital effects, so expect them to be simple, light, and a tad shrill, and one only result at a time can be executed. The FX600 doesn't have an LCD screen, unlike other multi-effects units on this list. However, it features a user-friendly 4-control interface that includes an output knob, two parameter knobs, and a mode selector. Price of £49, $60. Type, Multi-Effects Stompbox Amp. Models, NA. Effects, 5. I.O. 2 quarter inch inputs, 2 quarter inch outputs. We hope you to please use our comment section to reach us and we will always be here to attend to your comments. I hope you like our video. Do not forget to sign up for our YouTube channel. Always tap the bell icon to see our new and exciting videos update.